so that light would be slower than sound only because it was entering through a barracks that altercated it. Columns are great because they can have a depiction of an equalization, almost as the gutter's end route is all leveled out into the tipping of the gutter. This would be the decline where I first broke my collarbone as I couldn't turn enough. The wheels were turning too much. The gravel got let out from under it because of the angle was too sharp. This right over here um, marks the ground where I crunched the bone that cracked. These are all in tune with how much of a outpour the backdrop could have. In this case, the ground was... The I'm having a really time, hard time. I'm having such a time explaining polarization uh, of a computer into a physical thing. When the sun is behind the flag, it becomes transparent because the Mandalaya effect is pushing in all the threads. Light particles are captured all about it and are making it glow. Special effects, are they real or fake? Is something at a distance an illusion? And what would the simplest illusion look for the most comprehensive magnitude? The full effect. And so this pull on a white screen behind it, you can see that it's diffracting it. The polarization behind it was determinant of the the pull, how its makeup were diffracting. And that was because there's like some stripes on it. What if those two stripes had a polarizing effect jump to a different thing? This is electronic orbitals and how they're handled on larger scales. If you walk on sidewalks a lot, you're one to two feet away from cars, depending on how much they are close to the sidewalk. Noise crack at a distance and it travels to you later. To me, it flood, they see the flutter happening before I do. Space that's lit up between these branches is of a Mandalaya effect. Not seen too well when up close. And not that much either when it's... One thing that boggles my mind is how flies and pests are able to survive this winter. I was getting eight alive the last time I was here, and now there aren't any, which leads me to believe they have a whole bunch of eggs that are hatched, not outside, but within there. There's hundreds of thousands of mosquito eggs, I would imagine, waiting this whole time in there. How do they survive that long? The thing is like, if you play the Pink Floyd album on the second bar, of the line in the Wizard of Oz movie, it always matches perfectly. Even if you play it at a different part of the rock, it always seems to align perfectly every time. <laughs> That's the funny characteristic of AI. Whenever you're trying to get something, it always seems to click off the moment you try capturing it. And whether there's AI in small electric devices, to me is no different than an aberration of ghost being something eerie that you feel is a bad presence in the room. It's there. The earth being round as well as night falling allows for shades of different degrees to be as though there are branches collecting within. Nothing more than mere twigs to large branches as the differentiation of them are never the same. Those are what are inside gyroscopes when you're twisting and they're changing. The same stuff, but always in different angles. And especially with all the clouds how they are never all gone entirely all the time. They always come back. It's just as night and day is always in pattern. These two things are as even the clouds. Have you ever noticed there's never not any? Those must be branches as well. The Mandela effect is a physical attribute with happens inside of a barrier. The barrier of a sphere of the planet allows for it to double as like a massive chunk within the tree where the light goes above it 
and collects within the bushes branches as as though it could be a circle it would have to be above you as opposed to from the ground up and so it's just as how a pole can polarize a screen behind it uh, in the flashing of the differences captures a mandalay effect but more so like it's called like a b metronome it's just like if you listen to a really like well orchestrated song and then you put on a metronome you'll find that every time that they do like the chorus really well it always matches the metronome no matter what time you play the start button this is uh an, the thing is like if you play the pink floyd album on the second bar of the line in the wizard of oz movie it always matches perfectly even if you play it at a different part of the RAR, it always seems to align perfectly every time. Nothing more than mere twigs to large branches, as the differentiation of them are never the same. Those are what are inside gyroscopes when you're twisting and they're changing. The same stuff, but always in different angles. And especially with all the clouds how they are never all gone entirely all the time. They always come back. It's just as night and day is always in pattern. And maybe even the clouds. Have you ever noticed there's never not any? Those must be branches as well. The earth being round as well as night falling allows for shades of different degrees to be as though there are branches collecting within. The Mandela effect is a physical attribute which happens inside of a barrier. The barrier of a sphere of the planet allows for it to double as like a massive trunk within the tree where the light goes above it and collects within the bushes branches as, as though it could be a circle it would have to be above you as opposed to from the ground up. The sky is blue because it's as though there are branches all about it, except there aren't. It's just one giant roundabout where any tree could exuberate this as well, if it were large enough. And just as a ragged jump over a, a bump leaves the tail end to whiplash, it is no different than in between the two branches where light collects. It's from a distance where you start seeing the whole outline of the tree collecting light from within it versus outside of it. This is a raving scattering and why the sky's blue. But for every pinnacle there's an apex, one who overrides, and if you are able to conquer your enemy you can write their history books as well. And that's why when you see stuff that is made in China, that's us getting conquered as well. And the fact that they're polar opposite, meaning the oppressions of their peoples and deficits, that's when they're doing bad as well. So instead of making meteorites uh, like polarize platinum to fall from the sky lightly, gingerly, you know how like gold flakes can be found on food and ate? 